Hi students, in today's video, I'm going to teach you how to do division of time. Okay, let's look at the first question, which involves the dividing, dividing days and hours. We have 10 days, 5 hours divided by 7. So, we do the division using the long division method. Okay, first we arrange the time. So, we put 10 days, 5 hours inside and 7, we put it outside. We divide with the day first. 1, 7, 7. So, 10 minus 3, we have 10 minus 7, we have balance 3. So, these 3 days, we need to convert it to hours. We know that 1 day is 24 hours. So, if 3 days, 24 times 3, 4, 3, 12, 3, 2, 6, plus 1, we have 72. So, these 3 days, okay, we convert it to hours, we will have 72 hours. So, we plus 72 here. 5 plus 2 is 7. 7 plus nothing, we have 7. So this is 77 hours divided by 7. So 1, 7, 7. Balance is 0, we bring down the 7. 1, 7, 7. Balance is 0. So 10 days, 5 hours divided by 7, we will have 1 day and 11 hours. Okay, let's continue with the next question. Okay, this question, I will show you how to do the dividing weeks and days. We have 21 weeks, 5 days, divided by 4. So, we do the division using the long division method. So, we put the time inside. 21 weeks, 5 days. Okay, divide by 4. Okay, we divide the big first. 5, 4, 20. So we have balance 1. So we know that 1 week equals to 7 days. So this one, 1 week, we convert it to days. Okay, 1 week, we convert it to days, is the 7 days. So 5 days plus 7 days, we will have 12 days. Okay, so 3, 4, 12. So balance is 0. So 21 weeks, 5 days divided by 4, we will have 5 weeks, 3 days. Okay, next question. Okay, next question, I'm going to show you dividing years and months. We have 11 years, 1 month divided by 7. So, we do the long division method. We put 11 years and 1 month inside. And 7, we put it outside. So, we divide with the year first. 1, 7, 7. Okay, balance will be 4. 11 minus 7, we will have 4. Okay, we know that 1 year equals to 12 months. So, if 4 years, 12 times 4, 4, 2, 8, 1, 4, 4, 48. So, this 4 years convert to month, it will become 48 months. Okay, 1 month plus 48 months, we will have 1 plus 8, 9, 4. 49 months. So, 7, 7, 49. So, balance will have 0. So, 11 years, 1 month divided by 7, we will have 1 year, 7 months. Okay, let me fill in the answer. Okay, we continue with the next questions. Okay, next question, we will do dividing decade and years. So, we have 24 decades, 3 years, divide by 9. So, using the long division method. So, 24 decades, 
3 years divided by 9. Okay, 9 to 18. Okay, 24 minus 18, you will have 6. We know that 1 decade equals to 10 years. If 6 decade, it will become 60 years. Right? 6 decade, 60 years. Okay, so 3 years plus 60, we will have 63. So, 7, 9, 63. So balance will be zero. So 24 decades, three years, divided by nine, we will have two, de two decades, seven years. Okay, that's all for today. Okay, thank you for watching.